welcome to Shimmer Girl Talks. Today's topic, I'm sure most of you have seen by now, the young man defending his mother's honor, which it really is not his place, was not his place, especially at such a young age. But you see how he teared up at the end. No little boy, no child, period, should ever see their mother dancing in such a lewd way in public you know wherever no child should ever see something like this but you notice when he started crying at the end i think i got that in the the clip um his mother didn't even try to con console him or comfort him now you have a lot of black women out here um before i share that thought um just let's look at the video Okay, you see that. And the thought that I was about to share was, uh, you have a lot of black women, you know, saying how black men don't want black women and, you know, stuff like that. And then they'll shoot off of a variety of reasons the way they perceive the black men are talking about why they don't want black women. And a lot of times they be way off base, but I'm gonna try to keep it to this particular topic. A lot of those men get get to gets to that place long before they even leave their mother's home, their mother's house. And a lot of times it's a lot of black men's mothers is the reason why they don't want to deal with black women later on in life. And that can go so much further than what I'm going to touch in this video. <clears throat> I'll try to touch just a little bit. You have a lot of women who are as you can see with this young man don't know if there's a father in his life but i'm going to assume not and if there is a father in his life i, I don't want to make a, a, a judgment call on who his father is or what he's about but i'm willing to bet that there is no strong male figure in this young man's life and what he did was actually a strong male figure stance but he's 10, however old he is. I don't know how old he is. 10, 12, 13. He, it was not his place to stop his mother from acting like a ratchet garden tool. He should be an innocent little boy somewhere, you know, seeing his mother as a loving, maternal, you know, whatever, instead of a a garden tool on display and you saw the man that was dancing with her he was all ready to get it in and if they were somewhere alone his mama would have been 304 on her back in a second now obviously i don't know these people but this was so inappropriate and i feel so bad for a lot of children coming up with mothers like this and as i said in a previous video with the six-year-old rapping those disgusting disturbing lyrics and i said you have so many black women talking about that's why we need to go to other races because other race men this that and the other but who's raising these men and let me just make a just say this Every race has its degenerates, low class, ratchets, every single race. The difference is those other races typically do not put their lesser people on display as the default for the whole race. We do that. And I will say like within the past month or so, I've had black women coming at me for speaking out on the foolishness that goes on in our community. One woman on another platform that I belong to, she accused me of giving misinformation, even though I'm sharing exactly what in real time black women are doing. 
but I'm giving misinformation. And when I countered what she said, do you think she came back to say anything to me? No. And then just recently, I had this woman telling me uh, that I was seeking male validation. So what was the woman in this video doing? That wasn't seeking male validation? I find it so funny that the women in our race, when you're a woman and you're trying to, you know, be a decent woman, you're trying to understand where men are coming from so you could be a better wife, so you could be a wife. I've learned so much and I learned a lot, you know, before I was married, but, you know, since being online, you know, being, you know, watching some of the red pill content, looking at Kevin Samuels. And then you have a few women, you know, that I like to watch on YouTube as well. I've learned so much about being a better wife to my husband. That to a lot of women is seeking male validation, but shaking your big bubble butt against some man's crotch is not seeking male validation, according to these women. And I plan to do a video so look for it in the um, upcoming weeks. I've done black women and uh, protection before, but I'm going to come at it in, uh, from a different angle. Black women are protected. They're just not getting the protection that they want specifically. But um, that was my topic for today. I just thought that that was disgusting, disturbing, stupid, ratchet, however you want to say it. But uh, if you're new to my channel or if you just happen to see this video, please check out my other videos before you subscribe. And um, like, share, subscribe. Tell me what you think about this ratchetness. And I will talk to you later. Bye.